A decision you would have made some time ago when building a narrowboat is what engine you require for your boat because this needs deciding first because your shell boat builder would need to know the engine specification could they weld in the engine support engine bed frames so you can then gently drop the engine in later on in the project. As you can see here we have our engine ready to be lifted into the boat. We currently are using something called a Barris Shire 40 which is a 40 horsepower forcing the diesel engine. The preference is obviously to go to electrical power but that obviously costs more and you need a considerable amount of battery still. So on this boat we are still going down the diesel route but last year we built a boat called Robin which is totally electrically powered. So electrical power is the future but the technology and the costs are not quite in our favour as yet but will be soon. So this year we had no choice but to opt for the diesel plant here which we now lifted into the boat lined up with a propeller shaft which is already in and from there then put the engine, bolt the engine mounts down to the frame and it'll be ready for testing hopefully by the end of the day that engine will be running in the boat. Certainly no drama today, look at that, straight in, like a glove. <laughs> 